uh, my mother is an ex-nun, and my father is a former Franciscan brother, so I grew up admiring Jesus the way any guy would admire mom's first husband. But, um... <laughs> I have to admit, and I mean no disrespect to the faithful, I've come to view Jesus much the way I've come to view Elvis. I love the guy, the fan clubs freak me out. <laughs> I voted for Jesus last year. That's true, I voted, well wouldn't, wouldn't Americans love to vote for Jesus? Wouldn't he be so popular? Wouldn't the Republican Party love to get Jesus back to make him their nominee? Wouldn't anyone, I mean, wouldn't people vote for Jesus? Who wouldn't want to vote for a guy who was a peaceful, radical, nonviolent revolutionary, who hung around with lepers, hookers, and crooks, who never spoke English, was not an American citizen, anti-capitalism, totally anti-death penalty, anti-public prayer, yes he was, motherfucker, Matthew 6, 5, anti-public prayer, but never once anti-gay, didn't mention abortion, and was a long-haired, brown-skinned, it's in St. Paul, homeless Middle Eastern Jew. <laughs> for president. <laughs> that guy couldn't get a job at House of Pancakes. <laughs> no, no, Jesus, we're not hiring illegals. No, 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 no. Get out of here. I don't care who your father is, get out of here. There's no room at the IHOP. You come back here, you wear shoes. <laughs> and I like God, I do like God. I, I identify with his mood swings. Um, <laughs> Well, you're a kid reading the Bible, you don't know which God you're going to get. You know, he's kind of off his meds in some parts of the Bible. He, he loves you, but you're an abomination. But he'll always forgive you unless he sends you to hell. And he's almighty, all-knowing, and all-powerful, but really insecure and jealous and needs you to worship him. He's got a few ego issues. I'm a kid reading this, I'm like, that's not a God. That's an alcoholic dad. <laughs> Here I am, Lord. Abraham, what's up? <laughs> Abraham, check this shit out. All right? What's that boy's name, Abe? The one I gave your wife. The little boy that I gave your wife when she was 98. Uh, Isaac? That's the one. I. Right. <laughs> Here's what I'm going to need you to do. I need you to give me a solid. I need you to take that brat out in the fields and whack him. Okay, Lord, why? The fuck you say? <laughs> Stop the scrolls, the fuck you say to me? Minus one, dirt nap, take him out and smite him. <laughs> yes, Lord, okay, right away. Forgive me, my child. I do this for love. Abe, hey, what the fuck you doing? <laughs> Oh, that's the next chapter. You didn't hear that. No, no, no. <laughs> no, Abraham, there is something I need you to do, and you must write it down that all mankind might know my divine will. Abraham, ah, God Almighty, really do not like foreskins. <laughs> So as long as you're still holding that knife, 